This is a real DB. In any folder in your computer, in a terminal, run this command. Press enter. This will download and you will have the following file in that directory. You can see under the C users, my name, surrealdb, I got this file, surreal.exe. That's the executable. Let's run the server on that folder. The server will use the user admin and the password password. Enter, the server is running. In a new terminal, let's go to the client. Anyone in your computer, run this command. This command just connects to the Surreal server, port 8000, the user is admin, the password is password. We are going to run on a namespace called company and the database com company. We are going to make it look good by using the black pretty. Once you press enter, you are inside the terminal. Let's create a user. The user will have the ID of one, name UA, email ID H1. Paste it. The user has been created. That's the result. Let's create the second user, ID2, name UB, email at B, H2. Paste it. Press enter. The second user has been created. To see the users, select all from users. We can see user A and user B, one and two. If you only want to select one specific user, select all from users with column one, that will be the ID, press enter. You only see the first user. Let's create some items. Item one, copy paste. We have item one with the name, with the price. Item two, copy paste. We have the second item. To see the items, select, select all from items. We have item one and item two. If you only want to see one specific item, select all from item one. We only get that one. Here comes the amazing part about Surreal DB. If you want to say that user, user one bought item one with a price of eight, at this time, we run this command. Now it has been related. This is the data we get. The other way to do it is via this command here. So if we want to say that user two bought item one with this content, we can just copy and paste this command. Now user one and two have items that they bought. Here comes the amazing part of it. If you want to get the ID, whoever bought an item from inside this as board variable from user one, copy and paste it. We can see that user one board item one. We want to see more data about it. We can say, give me everything about whoever bought the item and give me everything about the item from user one, copy and paste it. And here we get information about the ID of the user with the name, with the email, and information about the item that the user bought. So this is SurrealDB in short. I hope you like it.